What's up Mario Kart fans, it's Ryder here and welcome to another new Mario Kart Tour video here on the channel. We will be predicting the Bowser Tour today. Very exciting tour with the return of GBA Bowser Castle 3, but with a very lazy addition of just being the background from the GBA Bowser Castle 1 and 2 tracks instead of just having the dark blue and open up Castle Sky. Really disappointing to see that. We do see some characters coming back like Meowser, Dr. Bowser, and even some new ones like Gold Charging Chuck. That's really amazing. And we can see some more new items like the red or pinkish off-roader, depending on how you kind of see it. And we also have got like a new Goo Goo Buggy. It's going to be a fantastic tour. I've, I've got a feeling this will be way better than the, the two that we've had recently. Because for me, I haven't really liked the two very much. But let's get on with predicting the Bowser Tour. Let's talk about the first pipe. For the first pipe for the Bowser Tour, we've got Meowser. Dr. Bowser, Red Off-Roader, Yellow Green Capsule, Magma Meteors, and the Wicked Topaz. This is a really fantastic pipe. All the pipes that get, all the pipes that are speculated to be coming are really fantastic. This tour, I've got to say, it's so amazing. Meowser, Dr. Bowser, Red Off-Roader, Yellow Green Capsule, Magma Meteors, and Wicked Topaz. A bunch of great items. Two of them are going to be brand new though, and usually the off-roaders are really good carts, and they've also got they've also got the biggest hitbox in the game. So that right there should just make you really want to pull for it, and it's a it's a really good cart. I feel like it will become a really good cart. Meowser's a coin boxer, so if you don't have him already, I suggest maybe going for the pull for him or something. And Magma Meteors, I feel like it's a really cool looking glider. And then we've got Dr. Bowser's regular set coming back as well. For pipe 2, we've got Bowser Jr. Pirate, Kemak, Charging Chuck, Dark Goo Goo Buggy, Magma Broom, Silver King, Beast Wing, Dream Glider, and the Bullet Bill Parachute. It's been a little while since we've seen one of these kinds of pipes with 3, 3, and 3. So we've got for characters Bowser Jr. Pirate, Kamek, and Charging Chuck, which were all shown off in the trailer and we decided to put them in the second week pipe and for cards dark goo goo buggy which is a new one magma broom which was shown off in a uh, older tour with a bunch of other brooms when it first arrived and now it's back in this tour in the silver king which we haven't actually seen in a little while if i remember correctly it might have been since uh Kamek's original debut tour i don't really remember exactly but i feel like that was the last time we've kind of seen it in a pipe i might be wrong let me know down below if, um, if i'm wrong about that and we've also got the return of the beast wing dream glider and the bullet bill parachute for the special pipe we think that there will be two characters that were hidden that weren't shown being lakitu party time and king boo luigi's mansion we chose these two because they really fit the aesthetic of the special pipe and it's mainly the minions for the other hidden carts carts and gliders we decided to include the cact r the silver bullet blaster the silver star shoot and the vampire wings and for the gliders, we also decided to have the golden wings for Chuck's glider. And I think Chard and Chuck gold will be Gigabomb, and he will be Spotlight. For the packs, there wasn't really anything shown in the trailer, so it was very, very, very difficult to decide which packs to include. So we basically threw in some random things that I came up with. For the first week $20 pack, we've got Nabbit. And for the second week $40, uh, $20 pack, We've got the brand new Bowser kite. Even though it wasn't shown in the trailer, I think that it'll be coming to tour now. As for the $40 packs, we've got we've got Bowser Santa and the Holiday King for the week one $40 pack. And for the week two $40 pack, we've got Gold Dry Bowser and the Gilded King. And for the $40 ticket pack, we decided to include the Wonderful Wings, which is a very random kind of item, but I think it'll be in a $40 ticket pack very soon. I couldn't think of really much much else to put in there so i just threw it in there for the commemorative we've got the red crawly cart returning from the halloween tour last year and i think it really fits well so i think it'll be coming back for the normal gifts we decided we decided to include shy guy the bullseye banzai and the minion paper glider mainly because they fit the aesthetic of the tour very 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 well and i don't really see anything else they could really do with it for the gold pass we decided to include king babam lax shy guy and the ball bomb parafoil mainly because they're all bomb related items and they're all really the dark kind of items as well so i think it would really be cool to have that stuff in there for the token shop we've got hammer bro paraway and the shell parachute kind of matched it up with what the theme of the tour is which is a bowser slash a minion kind of tour so 
We haven't seen any Hammer Bro Spotlight anywhere, so we decided to put in Hammer Bro Parawing and the Shell Parachute in the Token Shop. For the Ranked Cups, this is going to be a very exciting Ranked, I've got to say. First Cup, we've got Dry Bowser or the Charge of Chuck Cup. We kind of put Dry Bowser for the first week. First week, we've got GBA Bowser Castle 3, Mushroom Gorge R, and Chocolate Mountain RT. GBA Bowser Castle 3 is obviously the new track, and Chocolate Mountain RT was shown off in the trailer. Mushroom Gorge R has a few top shells for the first week pipe and a few from the uh, special pipe. And they could also add a bunch of new uh, top shells to these things as well. So we feel like this would be a perfect first week ranked. In Tier Shop Week 1, we've got Dry Bowser, Yellow Turbo Birdo, and Cheap Cheap Mass. Second week ranked, we've got GBA Bowser Castle 3T, Airship Fortress Normal, and Neo Bowser City T. I think it's about time Airship Fortress also returns with these tracks as well and Neo Bowser City. So seeing these two back also in ranked as well would be amazing. And it fits along with the tour very well. Airship Fortress has a bunch of the Bowser's minion kind of characters. And that's kind of what the special pipe is all about as you've seen earlier. So we think that Airship Fortress will return in ranked. And Neo Bowser City T will also be back in a ranked spotlight. Tier Stop Week 2 we've got... Bowser Jr., Wild Wing, and the Wario Wing. Thanks for watching, everyone. If you're new here to the channel, please subscribe, like, and comment below your predictions for this upcoming Bowser tour. Let me know down below. Also, do you like the new look to GBA Bowser Castle 3? Do you like it having the look of GBA Bowser Castle 1 or 2? Or would you rather have it as the darkest and blue kind of uh, look to it? Because honestly, in my opinion, that should have been just dark blue and the lightning kind of colors. Thank you all so much for watching and see you guys all in the next tour video. See you guys with my reaction next Wednesday. Peace out. Stay safe. Bye-bye.